going to say this the nicest way possible. This game has been probably the most troubling recordings I have ever done. And it's driving me nuts. So let me explain. Hey, we're back in the freaking Cit Cit Citadel again. I've recorded this two times already. Because they know how much I love this area of the game. Spoiler warning. I really don't. So... Let's get out of here for a third time. Actually, I lost an hour plus recording because the video just got corrupted. And I was like, seriously? Including two genuine reactions, which actually will matter. Which you will see eventually. So we're going to go ahead and eat a little bit because our Henry's hungry. We'll get him nice and filled up. Alright, I'm done with that. I'll see if anybody's in the kitchen. To get out of here, you need the goat blood and the key. Okay. Well, goat blood, or blood, goat skin filled with blood. To get the key, you come in here. And there's a key just chilling here. Do I get it? No, but you know. And then we go by Antonius. So there's Lucas. There's Jodoc. Antonius. I have everything we need. We're going to just take everything we get. All right. So I will see you in a few hours. <laughs> It's been a fun day, or a last day here. I failed writing Latin again. I made some potions. I waited through mass again. Probably fell asleep. It sounds like something I would do. Alright, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. No, I'm not. We're doing this right, which is... That I'm neglecting my daily schedule. Antonius. Praise be to God. For a moment there, I was worried you weren't coming. Give me that blood. This is the exact spot where you pushed me off the gallery. Yes, I did do that. Bye, Abbott. Okay. Now what, Pius? Now we slowly make our way over here. Dragged my lifeless body. Yeah, of course I did. Each go our own way. 
I was glad to help. I did what I needed to do and no one got killed. What will you do now? No. No. Get the hell out of here. I'm still the first horse I come across and ride until dawn. Far, far away from here. Yeah, I was thinking. Here. Take this. Show it to those cutthroat bastards and tell them you found it on me. You should convince them. Especially when they hear about the outcry here after the fires found out we were gone. Makes sense to me. That's what we're here for. Died. In a manner of speaking, I could promise you more luck than it brought me. Thank you. Thank yep. you for letting me live. You're welcome. I'm Gregor. My name's Henry. All right. Brother Henry. God be with you. Bye, Pius. Even fitting name. All right, so that's pretty easy, right? I mean, that's where it tells you to take back your things. Alright, so I should mention, my, uh, I'm not actually at home, so if things look weird and things sound weird, because I'm actually at my girlfriend's house because she wants me to be quarantined with her. Yay, quarantine. Oops, I have fancy stuff. Pebbles! Alright, let's get her stuff back. Now! About this. I'm overloaded. I mean, I'm really overloaded. Well, here's a few things we're going to do. Alright. See, I told you a moment ago that the game glitched for me. And, or my recording glitch, so I don't know how it happened. And that couldn't have happened at a better time. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to move my necessarily armor. To my horse. What the heck did I hit? Oh, a button. So my horse has a lot of stuff that I need. The only thing I want... How much can you carry? You can carry a lot. Actually, while I'm thinking about it. Um... Move both of these. This, I'll probably end up selling this, but I'm definitely moving my money to my horse. That's like one of the biggest things I want to do. And, I want to go... I just ran that guy over. Oops. I'm gonna go sell some stuff and then I'm gonna meet you at the meetup place. So, you know me. Alright, so what I'm going to also do is I have a lot of potions. Now, this is the thing that I wanted to laugh at the most. So, you know what I did for about like 30 minutes at the, the, at the uh, church? I made a lot of healing potions, because why not? Because those are going to come in handy. Why? Well, you're going to know why shortly. I just hope I don't lose my horse. That'd be the worst thing that could happen. Uh, it's that way, yeah. 
Alright, so we're gonna go meet the bandits. All we need is to set up a fire and use the die. If I get into a bot fight, I'm pretty much dead. Because my sword skill is not that good. Let's be honest. I'm an axe man. That's the only I can really think of because literally right after this we have probably some of the biggest story revelations that we've been looking for. Which is we can uh, so set the fire. I was about to say something else. It feels weird that I have nothing on, but I don't have a choice. What the freak? Morning, sunshine. Hope we didn't wake you. Good boy. You have to sneak up on me like thieves. We are thieves. Yeah. Besides, just make sure you weren't followed. Or trying to lead us into a trap. But enough of this chit chat. Let's get down to business. Let's get down to business. Trouble at the monastery. Question is, was it the right sort? Did you do that job we agreed? I went beer, but I wasn't. To defeat the Huns, ain't technically the Hungarians. Here if I didn't do it, how should I know? The world's full of idiots. It's done. You've got proof. We had this on us. Hmm. Aye. That says all right. What did you do with the body? Buried it. I dragged it away and buried it. That must have been quite a job. True, it wasn't easy. But if I'd left the corpse, they'd know for sure I was the thief. This way, they just lost a couple of novices. Or do you think it would have been better to leave the body there? Nah. I just had to make sure you did what was needed. Not even a mouse can get into that damn monastery. So no choice but to trust you. And do you trust me? Yeah. What now? What now? You did your job. Welcome. We need people like you. But what do you need people like me to do? <laughs> I'm just a crimp. All I do is recruit. Now you get to go to our camp and find out everything you need to know. Where? Are you seriously telling me you didn't notice the camp? Not too observant, are you? Well, there's a hill above Satav, and on top, there's an old abandoned fort. Only it's not as abandoned as it used to be. That's where the camp is. Go there and report to a fellow by the name of Eric. Tell him Kozlyev sent you. And they'll let me in just like that. Good point. I almost forgot. At the gate, show them the special die you took off Pius. That's our sign. That's all? That's all. You'll learn everything you need to know at Vranek. And hurry up. I've got a feeling there's something being planned. <sighs> okay, fair enough. Sounds easy enough. We have two options. We can go to Radzig or Hanish. I mean, I feel like we should go ahead and cut up the middle man and go straight to Vranik. So, where is Vranik? South of Sassau. 
Which we've really never been. So we're gonna fast travel to Sassel. It was funny, the last time I did this, when I did the recording last time, I got ambushed by peasants on the way here. And I'm like, what the freak? That's different. So, I was like, okay. Whatevs. And... There, I'm gonna give you one word of warning if you are playing along with me. It's gonna say it now, but it's gonna say it when we get there, but I'm gonna go ahead and tell you now. Yeah. If you have any quest you want to do, I would suggest go ahead and doing them. Yeah. Sass uh, Vranic is technically, I think anyway, is a point of no return. But I know the game's a lot longer than that. So I don't know if we can just come back to the... I know we have a lot of quests where you go back to back to back to back because of time restraints. So, and I don't know what I'm doing. What the heck? Yeah. Is, why did I do this? Ah! Stupid horse. Try this again. Yeah. Uh, what's the road at? Oh. Yeah. Well, you know, if you follow roads, you're probably better off. Wait, that goes nowhere. Are you telling me there's no really way? Oh, how did I get up there last time? Yeah. Skyrim tactics go. Southeast. Well, it is good if you do get close to it, you automatically discover the fast travel point. Yes, there's a fast travel point here. And I feel like you're going to be taking advantage of it. For a couple of reasons. God bless it. Maybe this game's more realistic than Skyrim. Actually, I knew that, but. It's funny, we've been trying to calm this hill for a while now, and we went absolutely nowhere. And we find our, our quick way to uh, Rate, because I think there's a road from this place to Rate. At least that makes sense. Ugh. Okay, I know where I'm at. The last recording. Can I... Oh, why not? I feel like that guy does make a good point. I don't think... I don't know how you're going to miss this place when you actually do find it for the first time. Could be it. A giant palisade fort. Actually, I'm on the back way, actually. That's kind of funny.
Brannick. With that said, next time on Kingdom Come Deliverance, before I get some food and me IRL, we will enter Vranic and see how massive is this account actually better than Purpose Lobbits. I think I actually said that right, which is the part that I'm probably the most proud of. I'll see you then.